Hey guys, so I know I had a couple of ARC videos previously on the channel, but uh, I figured you know I'd try it out since we did do the new update and everything along those lines. So we're gonna build a character here, which uh, yeah, there's a lot of different scrollers to go through. So how about I just meet you back after I'm done and we'll get this all started. Alrighty guys, we just finished creating our new character, so we're going to go ahead and start the game. And uh, just so you guys know, we are playing on the PlayStation if you didn't realize that already. So that's what that pop-up is down at the bottom. So it looks like we got something in our arm, like always. Alright, gained a level off the bat, that's always nice. Don't need that or that. Oh, so normally to start, let's go ahead and pump our health. And they did change out how all of the Ingrams work. So now there's tiers. So you have to unlock so many of a tier before you can move on to the next one. Oh. Already getting attacked? Man, that did not take long. It's the one bad part about this game. It is always out to kill you. Come here, bro. Bring it. Bring it. Oh man, that was a rough start already. Let's get a little bit more health, a little bit more stamina. Let's hurry up and collect some stuff and get the heck out of here. Before those guys decide to come back. Oh shoot. Yeah, let's go over here. Man, I forgot how slow swimming in is in all is in this game. I have to pump our speed for sure so we can get through that a lot faster. All right. So, number one rule of survival games: always punch the trees. Just all the trees, you just punch them. I'll have to make sure to get some some food going so we don't die. All right. So we got some berries, some wood, some sticks, all that fun stuff. Save those because those are actually really important. Alright. So we got a good amount of stamina, a good amount of health. Let's pump some weight so we can actually carry some stuff. Increase our movement speed so we can run. Alright, let's see. Grab some protection. And then we'll think about building a house. Probably need this thing. Oh, well, it looks like we're out of Ingram points. Oh, let's see. Alright, let's get some tools going. So we go up to craft, go to weapons, primitive, melee, and we'll build our first tool here. that in the first slot all right so this will let us be able to uh, collect stone and flint and a little bit of metal it looks like from these rocks all 
Now, uh, flint's really important early on to, um, to build your tools. So then you get more resourceful and actually build weapons so you don't get yourself murdered out here. Alright. What's it take to build pikes? Because that's actually super important. Or I mean a spear. Looks like we need wood. To get wood, we use our axe. There we go. Now I got some wood. So make we'll have three of those. Make things craft just a little bit faster. Oh, let's see. Grab that slingshot. And I'll start working into this good stuff. Oh, spyglass is important. Yeah, the sooner we build up that stuff, we won't have to have to go back into that menu. So we're going to have to start building some clothes here. So we'll go ahead and collect some uh, fiber up from these plants. Got to be wearing some pants. We can't be running around naked the whole time. And you're pretty tough, so I can't quite kill you to take your leather yet. Let's see. Armor. Cloth. And build a hat, shirt, and pants. Alright, now we got some clothes. Pump a little bit of oxygen so we can go swimming. Alright. Cooking pot. Bola. Alright. Let's see if we can take this guy out. I don't think we're going to do very well. Come here, you scrub. Man, this parasaur is still pretty darn fast, even in the water. Yeah, I think he's just going to get away. We're not going to be able to catch him. Well, that sucks. It's like we really need to find something to get leather from. That's not something to get leather from. That's something to run from. You might just have to wait on the bow. That's rough, though. Let's 
Let's see what we can get. Alright, I got the bow. I just don't have arrows yet. Let's go to crafting here and see what we can make. Maybe start building our house a little bit. Um, there it is, thatch. I was right on it. Go ahead and build four foundations. I guess five walls. A door frame. We're going to need more walls, though. A little bit more stamina so we can keep running longer. A little bit of water. Well, we can grab our arrows. And grab higher in foundations so we can eventually come back and build a better base. Alright. This doesn't look like a half bad place to build a place. So we'll go ahead and place it down. Get a nice little house started. Yeah, it looks like we're going to need quite a bit more walls. And to do that, we need to get some wood, get some thatch. Get some fiber. Make sure that Karna is not coming down to see us. Just a little bit more fiber. And we'll go ahead and finish up the house here. So, we said we needed more walls. So there's one, two. And then we can start working on the roof. Which will make a slope. Make two slopes. And then we'll get a slope roof pieces. All right. Now the reason I went with a sloped roof piece, so I can come out here. put it down so it makes the building taller so we have more room for activities on the inside and we'll get the sloped roof there and there there and there nice now we need a door
Oh shoot, that's not the button I wanted. Nice, now we're protected from the outside. Now we'll build a little fire here. Get started on all that fun stuff. Cook up some food once we get some meat. Might take a bit because you know all the animals hate us and want to run away from us and not give us hugs, but that's okay. So all the stuff I'm buying we will be using in future videos. But the faster I said that we can learn them and get them out of the way, the easier our lives will be. Alright, there we go. Campfire is out. Go ahead and eat some berries here get our food back up because we're looking a little hungry there in the middle eat all the berries and when I say all the berries I mean all the berries alright now we should be regaining some food might take some time, but we will. Don't really need the seeds. Some berries are important. Alright, I think the next thing that we need to do is definitely need to kill a dinosaur. It's the only thing that's holding us back right now. So we need to find a little dinosaur to kill. That won't kill us. Possibly look into getting some bolas to bring down a two-legged one. Let's see. Pretty sure that's under primitive range. Yes. Yeah, no, it can't do that either. But we'll get a bow. We can do that. get arrows just grab me a whole bunch of those all right guys now we have a bow that we can use to hopefully help us bring down an animal drink some water Let's see what we can't find Let's see if I can't take out this there we go Not quite what we needed, but I'll take it. We've got some meat. Some meat, some silico pearls, some chitin, some oil. There's a little bit of stuff from that guy. Really looking for a small little thing. Maybe some more of those compies that were attacking us earlier. Looks like we're finally geared up enough to take them on. And 
a couple trikes over here. These guys will probably kick our butts. What level are you? You are level 35 and you're mate boosted, so probably will kick our butts. Hmm. Oh, that's a big fish. Alrighty, guys, I'll be back once I, uh, I get something killed for you. Alrighty, guys, so off camera here, I was able to bring down this parasaur. And now we're finally getting some hide and some good meat going. So that hide is going to make our lives so much easier. We're going to be able to build bolas, build some better armor, and it's just going to be a, a happy, happy day. So we're going to go head back to base here. Gonna start cooking up some food. Right down here. So to cook your food, you just take your food and throw it in the slots over there. Make sure to always save your charcoal. It's actually very important later on in the game. And to start saving our supplies, we're gonna go ahead and build a nice little storage box. So we can leave all the stuff that we don't need right away. Oh, we're gonna need a little bit more fiber for that, that's fine. Should be some right out here. Go ahead and put our tool away so we can grab these. And we'll go ahead and build. See how many of these we can make. Looks like two. It's a good amount to get started. Oh, nope, not what I wanted. Come back. All right, we'll slap the first one as close to the wall as possible. Right there. And the one right next to it all right so we'll start throwing some wood and thatch fiber in here throw some flint stone hide and all that fun stuff in here throw the charcoal over here it's a pretty good start of our resources. Gonna heat these so we're not too hungry. Oh, uh, well, didn't want to eat the raw meat, but that's fine. We should negate the effects. Now we got the cook stuff. Just a lot better for you. So now we don't have to keep smashing on these berries. All right. Buy some gunpowder. Is that all the Ingrams we have? Finish off the armor suit. Combo spin is pretty good. We'll need that when we start a farm. Get the bigger box. We can start with our farming stuff right here all right oh that's not the door all looks the same all right next 
start collecting up some more rocks and stuff. We'll be right back once I get a good amount of resources together. Alrighty guys, well I did some grinding and I started to build up some more stuff. I'll show you some of the stuff that I built back at home once we get there. But uh, I did happen to make a bola, which is going to help us get some more hide. So what we can use this for is you spin it over your head and you throw it in an animal and you pin their legs so they can't walk. So then you can just sit here and stab them in the face until they die, which hopefully is soon. There we go. And then you can then chop them up and take their hide. It's easy as that. So they're not too expensive. It's actually kind of a net gain once you start getting the hide from them. So yeah, pretty cheap, only three hide. Go ahead and collect some more fiber. Go ahead and make another one so we can get some good hide going. And like I said, I'll be back once I get a whole bunch of resources and I can show you what we've done so far. Alrighty guys, as I was running around, I happened to find these two Lystrosauruses that I figured, hey, why not? They're a passive tame, which means you just throw some food on your last slot on your hot bar and you walk up to them and you press the action button. Just like that, I fed him a medjo bear and now he's taming some more. So I'd figure I'd tame up a couple of these guys, bring them back to base. They're pretty nice to have around. They give you bonus XP for you and all your dinosaurs that are around. So it's a faster way of leveling up. You bring them with you. They hang around. All you have to do is pet them and they do some tricks. It's pretty cool. Altogether, I think they're a fun dinosaur to have around the base. So these guys are almost done. Hey, there we go. We'll call you Lystro. All right. Thank you, game, for bugging out. Come on now, let me out of the menu. Well, guys, this might be unfortunate. I can't actually do anything right now. I'll be with you as soon as I fix it. Alright, that was really weird. Well, as you saw, we just made him do a backflip. But yeah, that was really odd. I couldn't do anything. I was just stuck in the menu. The, uh, the way I ended up fixing it is I just clicked the home button on the PlayStation controller. And it forced pause the game. But yeah, I have no idea what that was about. And we'll leave you the normal name. Just so we don't bug out in the menu anymore. Go ahead and pet you too. Yeah, doing tricks and stuff. And we'll go ahead and take these guys back to base. Alrighty guys, and I'm pretty sure that's all we're going to have time for today. But uh, check back, and we'll uh, probably have another episode out pretty shortly. Make sure to uh, subscribe down at the bottom, and make sure to click the, uh, the bell next to the subscribe button to get notifications for whenever I upload a new video. And you'll be able to see us next time and continue our adventure through this wonderful desert island of Ark. Well, see you next time, guys. It's been Wolfman Creates, and we out. Hey, guys. Thanks for making it to the end of the video. If you like what you saw, I got more up on the screen right here for you. And if you'd be so kind to leave me a subscribe, like, and make sure to comment down below.